In this second exercise, we are going to be going over a stretch and how to increase the intensity of the stretch through our breath. We're going to be stretching out our quads and our hip flexors, which are tight on all of us, including myself. And I'll teach you how to work with the mechanics of your breath to help increase and lengthen that part of your body. We're going to be starting in a half kneeling position. Key thing here is making sure both legs are on their own individual railroad track. So imagine you're standing or kneeling on a railroad track. This knee is in line with the hip on its own railroad track. Foot is in line as well. Then this foot is in line with the hip on the railroad track and legs are in line. That's the first part. Second part is we're doing again that posterior tuck, so our hips are moving towards our back. One cue I really like that works with most clients is if you imagine you had a tail and it's here, you're that shameful dog. So you're tucking that tail underneath you and right away you should feel that stretch in that hip flexor and in your quad. I know I do. Once we're in position, now we're gonna focus on our breath. We're gonna bring one hand on our stomach, one hand on our chest. And we're gonna breathe into our belly, breathing with our diaphragm, just like we did in the first video. Get in position here, hold that tuck, take a nice, big, deep inhale, Expand, and then with our exhale, seeing if you can let go naturally as our breath naturally lets go through the exhale. So again, I just want you to focus on the inhale, creating expansion, and see if you can increase the stretch. Exhale and release, and release any tension that your body may be holding through your breath as you exhale. So we're here taking a nice deep inhale, expanding through our body. Exhale, relax. Again, we want to keep our upper body, our neck and our shoulders nice and still through this practice, keeping our body in that relaxed state. 